We're entering an era in which our enemies can make it look like anyone is saying anything at any point in time. That might look like President Obama addressing the nation, but it's not. It's actually actor and comedian Jordan Peele impersonating the former president mixed with old video of Obama that was manipulated to match Peele's words. This is an example of what's known as a deepfake. It's a growing trend that's sweeping the internet. The technology can be used for some harmless fun, such as editing actor Nicolas Cage into movies he's never even starred in. In my world, it means hope. Well, here it's an S. Yes, this is actually a thing. The technology can even be used to make people with no rhythm look like they can dance. But deepfake technology also has a dark side. Both private citizens and celebrities have seen their faces put without their permission onto existing pornographic videos, posing a new challenge for privacy issues. Appearing to say or do something one never did can also have political ramifications. President Trump is a total and complete dip. Now, you see, I would never say these things, at least not in a public address, but someone else would. Someone like Jordan Peele. It's easy to imagine how this can begin to cause problems. Now, the US government has taken notice, and they've given CNN an inside look at a program they're sponsoring to get ahead of deep fakes. 